Hey guys, Steven Fillers here, back in the garage. Today, we're looking at the new action track by Ares. And with Ares, or Kurt Group, we have Keith. How are you doing, Keith? Doing great. Yourself? I'm doing great. Thank Fantastic. you. Fantastic. So tell us more about the action track. There are a lot of boards on the market today, but what's going to make yours stand out? Well, I'm number one, glad to be here to be able to show you this product. This is, this is one of the newest and latest and greatest products okay. in the market. What's really unique about it is it is a one piece construction. It's all aluminum. It's 6061 T6. Okay. Uh, it will support 650 pounds. Once you set your brackets and your boards, there's really no side adjustments to have to worry about. Um, and what's really unique about it, it's a step within a step. So what I mean by that is, literally we have a four inch step, open the door, now you have a three inch step. I love how fast and responsive it it's, is. It's remarkable. It is. Everything is also self-contained in the board, which makes it really nice. So when we're coming to the installation side of it, and we're also doing the wiring on, on okay. it, um, we're not really tapping into the electrical system. Okay. Everything is self-contained. That's great. So we give you the harness and the kit, we give you all the wiring, you punch your positive and negative to the battery, everything's self-contained, you put your triggers on the door, and you're good to go. Yep. What's really unique about this is this gives you an eight inch step and sometimes 15 inches below the deck on it. So with 650 pound support, you can actually use this to also get to your top cargo area okay. as well as climbing in to your vehicle and out a That's lot excellent. easier. So on a lifted vehicle as well as a stock height vehicle as this particular one is, and by the way, this is the new Jeep JL. Yes. Uh, this is a remarkable, remarkable piece of equipment as well. Um, it's just a very unique board, powder coat finish, 650 pounds of support, board within a board, all self-contained. Yes, sir, and I like how this is gonna grow with our vehicle as we put a lift on it if we want to. That's still plenty of clearance to get in and out of our vehicle. Yes, it is. The other great thing is how good it looks on this vehicle. It looks It almost fantastic. looks like it came from the factory that way, yes, which nice I really appreciate. Yes, nice and tight to the, uh, to the rocker panel. Uh, the other unique thing about it, too, is because the tolerances are so tight where the step deploys and also comes back into the step itself, the tolerances are so tight there that road debris, salt, water, grime, anything is not going to be really allowed to penetrate that very Great. well. Great. So you're going to have a nice clean step every time you step on that vehicle. Board. Okay, so now one of the questions I'm sure our viewers are going to have, if they have kids, how is this, what, what happens if they get their little fingers in there? Is it going to cause any problems or does it, does it stop itself? No, it's got some, some safety features built okay. into it that are really cool. And I'm going to demonstrate those for you. So let's say if you're up in the hills or if you park against a curb mm -hmm. um, and the step can't deploy. If something happens when the step comes in, it's automatically going to stop. Okay. When you close the door, it's automatically going to pick back up and go okay. in. Now let's say the door is open and your child is over here playing and the door gets closed. The board's going to come up it's automatically going to stop. Wow. When you open the door, it's automatically going to deploy and they close back in as well. Perfect. Now we also have another safety feature built into it, which is really cool. And that is if your child is at your door opening and closing your door, <laughs> which will happen. it's going to go into a default mode and automatically shut down for a period of about 30 seconds. Okay. And then it will reset itself as well. Great. So they're not going to mess anything up or anything. Correct. Great. Now we've also included LED lighting for this as well. Okay. So when you open the step, the LED lighting shines from the back forward, giving you a good clean view of the ground which in the step important. in the evening time. Yes, it is. <laughs> yes, sir. And one other safety feature that we have built into this is we actually have a bypass switch that okay. is mounted into the harness. So when you use your bypass switch, when the boards deploy, you can turn your switch off and it'll lock your boards into place. Okay, so if I'm like wanting to wash my boards off, that's perfect for that. Correct. Gotcha. All right guys, so moving on to the installation. Um, as far as the difficulty and the time that it took us to do in the garage, I'm gonna give this a four of 10. And for a first time DIYer, this is gonna be about a two or three hour installation. That's gonna get much better as you do a few of these if you are an installer, so just be aware of that. But we found one of the key things to making this install go smooth was just aligning the magnets with our sensors and our doors. Correct. Uh, anything to add there, Keith? Um, it's a pretty straightforward install. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, it's all a standalone system, which makes it really nice, so we're not having to worry about Absolutely. tapping into the electrical system or, or having any malfunctions with the computer system by having to tap into the system. Not having to adjust the boards and the bracket kits so that they are twisted because it is a solid one piece, 6061 T6 aluminum. Uh, the brackets go on really nice, one thing to note. Uh, you do want to leave those brackets loose until you actually set the boards on and then you come back and tighten everything up and you've got a nice clean look to it as well. Uh, makes the install very simplistic. Yes. Of course some vehicles are going to vary uh, like this particular model. This is the uh, JL model and the JK has some different routing 
you know, possibilities for the harnesses yes, as yeah. well. So with every install, you do run into some difficulties, and we do like to make sure that you allot a bit, of, you know, a little bit of time right. for, um, you know, rerouting through the firewall and, and stuff like that. And I think for the two to three hours it takes to do this, it's well worth it for the final product. Definitely is. All right, guys, so that's a wrap for the Action Track by Ares. Keith, thanks for coming out today. My pleasure. Thank you for having us. Yes, sir. Thank you. Now, guys, at home, if you want any more details about the Action Track, check the description below the video. We'll have everything for you there from a part number all the way to a dealer locator so you can find these and have them installed at a dealer near you. Now, if you like the video, leave us a like. If you love the video, feel free to subscribe and click the bell icon for notifications anytime we release a new video. Thanks again for tuning in. This has been Total Truck Centers in the Garage.